I've been drawing cartoons my whole life, and yet somehow I've never done a comic strip. So this year, one of my really important personal projects was to create a comic strip just for myself. I withheld the option to never show it to anyone, and I was only going to work in traditional media, just pen and ink and watercolor and colored pencil on paper. And I guess that was because I do a lot of digital stuff for work, and I didn't want all the distraction of being online or it's also very time consuming to try to get everything perfect. So I wanted to take the risk of jumping in and working on paper. So the first thing I had to do was to create a sketchbook for this. And actually creating a book is usually something I do at the start of every project. So I made this book. And um, when the Charlottetown Zine Fest came around in November, I discovered that I'd filled the book and uh, actually had something to show. So I scanned that all and bound it into this. And I was pretty happy with how this came out and the reception that it received. So I decided I want to keep going with this project, which means making another sketchbook. And uh, I filmed that process, sort of. Pretty much everything that could go wrong did, because I'm still very new to this. So the a tripod boom arm would slowly drift and I would lose the thing that I was trying to shoot. Or the camera would cut out or I stuck my finger with a needle while I was stitching the signatures of the book and bled on the notebook, thankfully on the part that gets glued in. So you never see that, but I did get there in the end. Uh, so here's that footage, but since it's pretty crappy, I'm also going to link to uh, for one, a video of mine where I show how I uh, find a comic and then a proper video about how to make a sketchbook like this one, uh, which uses something that's called a signature binding because you have signatures, groups of pages that are called signatures and they're stitched together and then bound as a book block into a, a hard case or cover. So here we go.